mom was at. The what? twins, where are the twins? They're, they're in the limo. Did they make it out? Did our parents make it out on bet? Come on, let's go find them. Come on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you going? No, you can't be here now. Parents, I think they might be inside. Brett, Both of them work here. Come it's on, Jefferson. Not safe here. Chris G. No, I, help I, find their Jefferson, parents. it's fine. Jefferson. Go with him. Uncle Philip. Philip? What happened to you? Where's mom and dad? It's all a mistake. What? It wasn't my fault. What are you saying? I think Don's in there with him. Comfort with the knowledge James and Don died together. Embraced in their deep love for each other. Let the earth receive their bodies as the Creator will surely receive their souls. God bless them both. <laughs> To help heal us from this terrible loss, please share your remembrances with us. I'm sure you're all feeling what I am right now. Losing Jimmy and Dawn is an unexpected and terrible tragedy. They were two people who lived passionately and loved fiercely each other and everyone around them, especially their children. You seem to be holding up. By a thread. You should be in there. Don't. Aunt Betts is already in there, soaking up all the sympathy. She's telling everyone that they're leaving the rental and moving in here with you. Look at it this way. Once the hotel's rebuilt, they'll move back out. They'll never move back out. I know it. You've got two years before you leave for college. You can handle that. Or you can just leave. Me? Sure. If you don't like it, go. You'll figure something out. I know you will. <clears throat> what are you two doing? You're supposed to be out there helping the guests, not in here kissing your boyfriend. You want me to go cry in front of everyone? Is that it? <sighs> you're upset. I understand. But you're moving into my family home without asking. Did your uncle not speak with you? We're your legal guardians now. The lawyers are drawing up the paperwork as we speak. I have no say in this. Sweetheart, we had to do something. You can't live in this house with your brother alone and we need somewhere to go, so it worked out perfectly. Well, I want Jefferson and I to live with Bronson. He's a very busy man, Christy. He can't take care of two kids. No, 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 this is time for us to pull together as a family. And you just can't have everything you want. My mother started to tell me something on my birthday about a curse looming over the Cutlers. She tried telling me, but I, I thought it was silly. It's more concerned about my party. Hey, all families have their problems. This is different. It's generational. The fire and my parents' death. Now, Philip and his family moving in. I'm starting to believe it's real. <laughs> 